Gucci Spickly Scarab, she's delicious. Eliva, welcome to your love tarot reading. Today we are going to be taking a look at your general energy vibe check in love. We are going to see what new fishies are swimming at you in the sea of love. Mm -hmm. Who's out, who's in, and who is getting deleted from the database, baby. Let's see, please show me in calls. Angel of love, goddess, of your deity, what is coming through from my baby Libra. So I'm going to rise in your penis. Ooh, Libra. Ma. <laughs> Ma. You've been, oh my gosh, Libra, this is hot, hot, hot energy, but be careful because someone's tempting you with something here. All right, let's see, page of cups at the bottom of the deck, Libra. You got, you got one person looking at you right now in secret. This is someone who's been, um, I don't know, like stalking your social media. Someone's been like looking at you, checking you out, thinking about you. They're like, meh, meh, meh. Chats, you know they're just like they're like kissing their phone <laughs> seriously kissing their phone you got a secret admirer of some kind could be a friend could be someone that you're not aware of but someone's just like obsessing over you maybe you, you know who it is maybe you don't let's see yeah the hermit i think it's like an online thing um you know more than anything else even if you know this person like in real life i think they just like stalk your social media and fantasize about you a lot um Something could come of this, actually, in, in, in the future. Something could materialize from this crush. Someone has a massive crush on you. Uh, baby, right now you got the devil in your midst, all right? This is your present energy of the devil herself. Listen, the devil in a love reading is, is passion. It's romance. It's, you know, scrumptiousness. It's two people who can't get their hands off of each other. What is going on? I think... Libra, I think you're about to meet someone or you already just met somebody new and you're wondering like, is this person real? You know, is this, if you're wondering if this person wants a commitment, they do, like commitment with a capital C. And if you're wondering if this person is, you know, if you're looking for a fling, if you're on the rebound and you're wondering, is this gonna be, you know, any good? Is this bad for me? Should I do it? Should I not? Go into this with your eyes wide open because it is going to be fiery. It is going to be scrumptious, spicy. This is as spicy, hot, hot, hot as it gets. But there's always a price to pay with the devil. So just keep that in mind. The Knight of Swords is crossing your path right now. You have a new booby coming into your life. Just, you know, with that devil energy, I would just... <clears throat> I would just be mindful that if you're looking for a fling, this is going to be a fling and it will come with some kind of a consequence. So, you know, it's a person who's like coming fast in, fast out, you know. Uh, could be someone who comes in, um, steals your heart and runs away. So just be careful about that. Also, mm, however, if you're looking for commitment and someone's been telling you things about commitment, you're wondering if they're telling the truth because you think that they might be a player. Uh, they're not. They're telling you the truth. Um, they just talk about it a lot because it matters to them a lot. So it all depends on your context and on the situation, my baby. Also, before we get into your reading, Libra, let me just say welcome to Blue Angel Love Tarot. If you're new and if you are a returning Blue Angel, thank you. I appreciate you. I love you. I see you, baby. Give mommy a kiss. Give me a little bit. Oh, I love you so much, Libra. I'm Scorpio Sun and Rising. We're neighbors in the Zodiac. You know how it goes, right? Hmm. You had a situation in the past where uh, someone either cheated on you or made you feel like you weren't good enough. They were comparing you to other people with that Three of Pentacles energy here. Mm, you felt like someone was keeping their options open. And I, th I think it was a dating situation. I don't think it was a relationship. Maybe it was. Um, if it was a relationship for you, that's like, you know, that was a very painful energy. Somebody, maybe you found out somebody was um, even like cheating on you at work or something like that. Um, and don't get triggered if that if you're not aware of this, then that's not that part of the reading isn't for you. But there's something in the past that like, you know, you, you felt like a third wheel or somebody was like putting other people into a relationship or a connection and then made you feel like a third wheel. Um, that's okay. That person wasn't worth it, you know? That person was not worth it if they were not prioritizing you. Maybe they pri prioritize their work as well, or they prioritized people at work or their uh, family of origin and stuff like that. 
that's just not good enough. You need a higher order of love, my baby. And look how wonderful the spread on my table is the devil crossed by the knight of swords and next to the devil are the lovers. And this is the knight um, and day, the light and the dark, uh, the up and the down in the tarot. These are two cards very much related to each other. So there is love coming your way from the devil, from this, you know, question, from this temptation comes love. There's love coming your way, baby. There's, this is like, you know, it's May. This is your May energy, but this is going into the summer, really. So a lot of people are getting this reading today where it is the summer of love. You're coming into the summer of love itself. Uh, the lovers is crossing your path. Bringing you so much joy. So, you know, if, if you're looking for commitment, the person who's crossing your path right now or is about to, and they will, trust. They're, they're, it's like someone's just, if you don't have that boo-boo in your life right now, boo-boo will just like come into your life like boom. And it's going to be like instant, like sticking to you like glue. Somebody wants that commitment. Um, but what you're not expecting here, Libra, is that you're not going to be sure about this person. For some reason, two of pentacles, you're not going to be, you're not going to be as committed to this as this person is going to be. You're not going to be as sure. You're not going to be as, you know, this time around, you're not going to be as certain. Hmm. This isn't your, uh, this isn't that little person, little person. It's, an, I was, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it like that. Like, this isn't that little bit bit who, um, who is, um, don't cancel me. Not today, Satan. This isn't that little boo-boo who has a crush on you from afar. This is another person who got, you know, more than one energy uh, in your life. Maybe you're going to find out who this person is with the crush, and it's going to make you think twice about this new commitment. You have the Ten of Swords crowning your energy. Um, so there may be lessons here about, um, you know, ending things and knowing when to end something, even though it's tempting. So you could, you know, you could be potentially meeting someone who's going to fall in love with you and want a commitment, but you're going to know that it's not going to work out for you and you need to learn how to say no. Um, because there's something about this person that's just not for you or, or it's a commitment you can't make. So it's about being honest or it's about, you know, knowing how to, be, uh, how to be discerning, knowing how to choose. And with that devil energy here, you know, this is always about the consequences of your actions. So make sure Libra, Libra, I know you. Okay, baby. Like this is, Scorpio is the same, but Libra in particular is so charming. <clears throat> you attract a lot of people. So it's, it's kind of like what I'm getting here this summer is you may be, you know, you may be breaking some hearts. Don't, you know, <laughs> I'm not judging, okay, but, uh, and I, you know, I recommend that for your mental health sometimes, you know, to be, not to focus on one person at one time, but, you know, make sure that someone doesn't think that they have a commitment with you and you're still talking to other people, because I, I see that coming back to you here. That might hurt you in the end. Um, if you're playing two people off of, off against each other, you're dating two people at the same time or three people, make sure that, um, you know, everything is above board, because I see that this might cause some, some pain. And also, if you're going, if you're not looking for commitment with that devil energy and the knight of swords, if you're only looking for a fling, always just remember that there's always some kind of a consequence. I don't know what the consequence will be for you because it's a general reading, but <clears throat> there's always some kind of a con. There's like a payoff for that, um, like there is for anything, any kind of love. There's some kind of a payoff. Um, it doesn't have to be the worst thing, you know, but just know that. Um, you know, you can start a fling with someone and you fall in love or they fall in love with you. There's some kind of a, a, an exchange that needs to be had and a, a sacrifice that needs to be made upon the altar of the goddess of love in this scenario. I don't know, Libra, but it's all looking very hot. Like, you know, still, still, it's all looking super hot. Just make sure that no hearts are broken. Not yours, not theirs, not anybody else's. And I feel like you're going to find out who this um, secret admirer is, but it may not be until Virgo season this year because this person is going to be slow to come out of the woodwork. All right, baby, let me know in the comments below if this is your story. Also, if you vibe with my channel and you appreciate my videos, why not subscribe, turn on the notification button, and like the video because that really helps your mommy out as a small creator on YouTube. And if you'd like to get a personal reading with me, all the information is in the description box below. Also check out my magical offer. I offer magical spell services. If you want to help your love along the way this summer, hit me up. All the information is down below. I will also be doing a live this weekend. I just don't know if it's going to be Saturday or Sunday yet, but I will keep everybody posted. I love you, my baby. Stay sparkly, stay gorgeous, stay moisturized, and may the angels protect.